Forget it. Ah, now this tie goes with anything. Brown, striped, gray, and it's fully lined, see? Yeah. Uh, maybe you like bow ties. I got a bow tie. This is lovely. Everybody's wearing bow ties. What now. are you doing, Bush? You know I don't like bow ties. You always try something bow ties, something in a solid color, you know? Uh, hey, Lieutenant! Wait a second. Hey, Lieutenant! You're a colors man, ain't you? I got ties in all school colors. Tell me, where'd you go to Fordham, CCNY? I went to Barnard, Martian. How many years have I been telling you to stay out of the squad room? 22. Get out of here. Oh, well, well, maybe you don't need any ties, but I got other things, Lieutenant. I got wallets, I got socks. Oh, I got beautiful handkerchiefs. Hey, Lieutenant, you got a crumb on your mouth. Yeah, sure. Irish linen, right? That's right. So how come it's stained with Coon Danish? Good defense. Thank yeah, you. Yeah. Where are you going? Hey, Cyrus, I got some other ties for you, Billy. Well, what do we have? Well, let's see. What's up, y'all? What's going on, man? It's your big homie, Big Betty, man. And this is the Real Talk, Real Shit Podcast. And I uh, have a very, very, very important, strong message, man. And let me light up my, let me light up the incense for this one, man. I have a very, 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 very important message. And this is for the chosen. This is for my chosen. And this ain't. This ain't for the uh, average Joe Blow. This is a message for my chosen people out here. And I know, you know, all these you got all these fake, fake ass uh, people on the internet trying to join the wave and do shit for clout. Do shit. I don't do none of that. I'm speaking from the, from the heart, pure from the heart, man. And I and I and I stand. I stand with God. You know, I stand with God all the way through. You know what I'm saying? And I and I'm not under no religious denomination. I'm just straight for God. Let me just explain something to y'all. When you're a chosen one and you're living in the truth, and you're standing in the truth, and you're living like that, and you really like that. For one, er, uh, all the evil people around will try their best to attack you you, stop you, slow you down, uh, distract you, break you down, and everything that in their possibilities to, to stop you. I don't know why we're living in a time where the truth is is such a scary thing. Because I, w- I was going to say bad, but it's not bad at all. I don't know why we're living in a time where the truth is such a scary thing. You know, um, people are so scared of the truth. Look, put it like this. I had somebody um, that I'm around. I'm not gonna say no names because I don't talk. I don't like to talk about people behind their back because I'm not a coward, and I have no um, hard feelings toward many people. You know, it's not a lot of it's not a lot of people in this planet that I don't like, or you know, it other than evil people. I don't like evil people. Um, if you're on the other side, I don't really like you, and I have nothing for you. But I'm not gonna hate on you. And I'm not going to have any bad wishes for you because when I, when, when you or anybody has, when you harbor some negativity towards somebody else, you're blocking your blessings on in your life. Because if you're always conjuring up some negativity on somebody, or you're like, oh man, I hate them. Uh, now you're in the darkness. Now you're of the darkness. Now you become a hater. Now you become a... Uh, become like an evil dude because you start thinking of ways to stop them or to 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 not like them. So according to the bill of lady, the driver was carrying about a million dollars worth of morphine. Well that's a switch. In Marseille it figures, Bolivia, Morocco. I mean they've got the facilities to extract the heroin, but here? Yeah. The only thing that I focus on is staying in the truth, staying in the light, staying positive. Because like I said, the truth, it'll set Do you we free. appreciate greatness coming from one of the greats. We remove road models, put some actors in their place. They think that they are here, but it's factors in the race. Maybe unpopular, but I can look you in the face. Do we appreciate greatness coming from one of the greats? We remove road models, put some actors in their place. They think that they are here, but it's 
factors in the race may be unpopular, but I can look you in the face. They should just start me, and all they want is our attention. Common misbelief and misconception. The life we live in, used as a weapon, nothing used against those with no protection. We live, we make mistakes, just learn the lesson. Get love from overseas, and it's a blessing. No Grammy nominees, but I'm not tripping. We work our life away with no progression. We down to our last, we gotta stretch it. Can't walk this road alone. Somebody help me, just bring a change of clothes. Cause it get messy when it's all said and done. We making history, this world is all love. Misunderstanding, but what's the missing piece? Now that's the question, Do let's we go. appreciate greatness coming from one of the greats. We remove role models, put some actors in their place. They think that they ahead, but it's factors in the race. Maybe unpopular, but I can look you in the face. Do we But the truth will protect you. Um, you know, I'm a, you, I, it, put it like this. You will get persecuted. You will get tried. You will go through plenty of tribulations in this modern time living in the truth. Because the truth is such a thing right now that it seems as if, it seems as if evil is in control of the, of the modern world. It seems that way. And I feel like God is in control of everything. And I and I want to believe that God is in control of everything. But the modern world, the way it's set up, it seems like evil is running this shit at the for the time being. You know, it seems like you come across way more negative uh, shit bags than than you do positive good people. You know, uh, and that's why I'm on here doing the best that I can to even the playing field because I would love to come across more positive uh uplifting uh good spirited type of people but like i said it, it doesn't seem to be the case you seem like you're running run against more losers than winners okay it's the street drug smack mojo's not that easy to get rid of where'd you go to school harvard yale princeton Collin. Hey, huh? A few I showed him with a touch of prune data show me two dollars marsh was here huh? now where would the heisters get rid of a load of morphine too many places they try to unload it they wouldn't get value for it the mob would they touch it i mean they'd have to smuggle it out of the country refine it into heroin and then smuggle it back that's a long rough road mac and a lot more tourists than it's worth and most important time street pushers they want to make the quick hit and get out an educated guess they're looking for a buyback mr dexter buyback now we believe the heisters will try to get in touch with you in order to make a deal with your merchandise um so when you're living in the truth and uh like i said to all the chosen people when you're living in the truth you will be talking like today uh well, first let me tell you what happened uh the other day i was i was getting uh ignored where i was at my folks wasn't talking to me and a lot of times people don't talk to me but then there's a certain group of people who always gravitate to me and always want to hear what I got to say and they value my opinion and they value my word. And those are the people who are seeking wisdom, seeking guidance, or those are the good people. You know, because the good people, it's like, you know, like minds attract, you know. And um, and I'm not against nobody. I, I can talk to the dirt bags, I can talk to the evil people i can deal with anybody because i have so much truth in me i have so much light i have so much strength in me i can deal with anything you know so when i was getting ignored i asked the people i was like why y'all don't say nothing to me man why y'all don't ever talk to me like or why don't y'all hardly ever talk to me i was like damn i want to um like i don't want to be included and i don't need attention but i was like damn you know it just feels bad that people can ostracize you and ignore you Especially when you have such a important, valid opinion on shit, and not, you know, whatever. So the person said, "Oh, we're having girl talk." Oh, 
I know how to damn communicate with females. And then she said, Really? The only reason why I ain't saying nothing to you because you're going to tell the truth. This is time five, everybody stand up. Put your hands to the sky if your life is precious. We got now, but they say we next up. We had no volunteers, so I had to step up. This is time five, everybody stand up. Put your hands to the sky if your life is precious. We got now, but they say we next up. We had no volunteers, so I had to step up. The truth they duck and dodge, time don't come to play. I was on the team for years, they ain't put me in the game. If you take a look now, man, I put them all to shame. I was cooking in the kitchen and them boys just stayed the same. So I separate myself, man, I'm in my own lane. The coach and Miz got it, man, we dig our own grave. We see it at the light, then we turn the wrong way. It don't matter where you go, cause it happen every day. I'm a little light, I hope, in the land of the brave. It take a little time if you ask me what it takes. But he threw his life away for the boys and the fame that you stay us in the face. Let's go. It's a time five. Everybody stand up. Put your hands to the sky if your life is precious. We got now, but they say we next up. We had no volunteers, so I had to step up. to uh, monitor all your calls. No problem, of course. We're concerned about this as much as you are. Full cooperation goes without saying. Yes, that's right. We have commitments here for this morphine to supply hospitals, pharmacies all over the city. Hmm. Cheers. Do you process your own morphine, Mr. Dexter? Well, you might say we are. And, I, and when, she, when this person said that, I was like, I said, eh. I said, what? I said, the truth, I said, the truth shall set you free. I said, the truth is a beautiful thing. Like, what are you talking about? And and she was like, basically like, yeah, you're gonna tell the truth, you know. Out. So that, right then and there, that shows that person's side that they're on already off the bat because um, that particular person gives me problems all the time and I, and I don't come with nothing but pure I mean, pure, I come with pureness, I come with love, I come with good intentions, I come positive, and I'm ready to cooperate, do what I got to do, but that person always gave me a hard time. So I don't care about that, and I'm not talking about that person, because I got love for that person, even though they're uh, lost in the sauce. But, um, so, like I was saying, Packagers, Lieutenant, uh, we have the material flown in, medicinally pure, in powder form or liquid, then uh, we bottle it, uh, label it and sell it to our own outlets and this shipment here was in powdered form completely morphine sulfate 84 to 85 percent pure what do you want me to say if they call well i'll brief you on that later mr doctor which is why i want to be here when you say it well uh how are we going to arrange that well, you just tell your secretary that you're not in, and if it's important to call back after six, I'll make sure that I'm here, and then you tell him. Well, I want my chemist to examine it to make sure it's pure mojo. Mojo? Yeah. Mojo, morphine, Mephistopheles, spins and needles, uh, cubes, and Emma. Uh, dozen street names for it. Mojo, the words they use. Now, how many people know about that shipping? Ten, twelve. Do you think any of my employees were involved? <laughs> well... They did know the driver's route, didn't they? And they knew where he stopped for his prune danish and his coffee. They also knew what he was carrying. Of course, I believe they had inside help. Which is why I want a list of all the names they knew about that shipment. And we in turn will check with the consigner in Toledo. I'll uh, get you your information, Lieutenant. So, to, like like today, I'm just gonna give off examples. Um, I was talking to, to a young lady and we're having a conversation about, you know, personal things and uh, love and stuff like that. So as I'm talking, that, that same person who said that, that I'm going to tell the truth started getting upset, slamming stuff. Uh, you could feel the energy. like uh, 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 You could feel the shit coming off of them. They don't want me. It's like they don't want me to tell the truth. Every time I start saying something, I don't speak a lot of that where I'm at because I don't want to push my opinion on people because in a public environment, 
just gotta do what you gotta do and not push push it on the people, you know. Um, you could just give little breadcrumbs and leave them, give them a cup of water, but you just gotta leave them to the water. You don't force them to drink it, you know, because I'm not trying to force anybody into this because the lifestyle that I'm living is not for everybody because everybody's not a chosen. So I understand it's a lot. It's a lot being chosen and it's a lot to deal with and it's a lot so I, I don't want to put that weight on everybody so I don't even try to impose my ways on people you know what I'm saying so when as I'm as I'm talking to the young lady you know giving her wisdom and le- and listening and learning at the same time we're back and forth because a uh, conversation that is, is a back and forth uh, not a tug of war but it's a give and give it's a give and take thing you know I'm giving a little energy I'm taking a little energy I'm giving a little energy I'm taking a little energy we're going back and forth you know sharing energy and uh, sharing words and experiences and conversation and stuff so like I said the other person's getting mad getting frustrated Yeah, this uh, this thing is here for show. Does it really tell time? Well, for two thousand dollars, Lieutenant, I should hope it does both. They see me calling, they're not picking up the phone. When you change for the better, you may spend some time alone. I'm dropping back the bag, cause right now I'm in my zone. They done with their play, left some meat on the bone. They see me calling, they not picking up the phone When you change for the better, you might spend some time alone I'm dropping back to back, cause right now I'm in my zone They was done with their plate, left some meat on the bone They gave time to microphone, he gon' say what's going on Had they time at the top, now I'm coming for the throne Only got one trick, so they say I'm showing off I switch my style up, and some people wrote me off My flow would be so sick, stand too close and start to call Transaction history, paid the cost to be the boss Them haters on my trail, so I had to shake them off They got chains on the dope, I came through to break them off Teamed up with my homies, some might say we taking off When you hear a time verse, it's so unmistakable I open up your mind every time I kick my flow Gotta have a peace of mind, it's so irreplaceable Let's go Just the same, man I'd hate to send John Cameron Swayze down to Colorado Rapids with a job like that. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Gotta have a peace of mind, it's so irreplaceable, let's go. They see me calling, they not picking up the phone. When you change for the better, you may spend some time alone. I'm dropping back to back, cause right now I'm in my zone. They done with their plate, left some meat on the phone. They see me calling, they not picking up the phone When you change for the better, you might spend some time alone I'm dropping back to back, cause right now I'm in my zone They was done with their play, left some me on the phone, let's go Uh, slamming stuff, you know, having, you can feel the disdain, you can feel the hate You can feel the shit, and even the person I was talking to was like Damn, let me stop talking to you, cause I'm making, I'm making, we're, we're and I, you know, we're making that person mad But it wasn't the person That, uh, that really does it for you, huh? Where's Marty? How should I know? We can blame it on this, but the facts still remain. You stuck in a cycle, we don't have no other way. I can drag you through the roof, we still die every day. We follow me to home, and this is the minute place. You should know, Harry. Make that your business to know, until all this is over. Now this is one fat score. We get caught. We get thrown in jail for a long time. We don't know which way to go. We don't know which way to go. We don't know which way to go. Though it seems we going down. We don't know which way to go. We don't know which way to go. We don't know which way to go. Though it seems we going down. We can blame it on this, but the facts still remain We stuck in a cycle, we don't know no other way Popping value through the roof, we still dying every day We falling in the hole, man, the system been in place We taught to hate each other, but we really are the same It's a rich man's game, but we got the same thing We got clothes on our back, some might have a bigger name Bodies dropping on the news, man, here we go again 
I'm uncomfortable and some are scared of change Either way it go, man, something gotta shake My son, 10 years old, and the challenges he faced Give me the motivation to stand up and break we the chains We don't know which Let's way go. to go We don't know which way to go We don't know which way to go So it seems we going down We don't know which way to go Two murder warrants out from the national. They picked me up, they throw me in a hole for life. So you tell that brother of yours not to wander, not to jinx up the campaign. He pulls any numbers on me. I'll kill him. All right. All right. You, you think this setup was your idea? Well, it was me invited you in, remember? You saying you want to call the shots, Harry? There's a demon. There's an evil spirit. There's a demon that will take control of somebody who's not totally good or not totally in control of their self. And they won't even understand or have control of what they're doing or even fully understand what's going on. They're just reacting to that demon jumping in them and taking control to try to stop or block what's being said or done. So when you when you have when you're a chosen one, you have to understand that demons are always going to be used to uh, to try to break you, stop you, uh, keep you from spreading the truth and keep you from spreading love and life into people, talking life into people. You know, because we can speak life into each other. You know, even in the Bible it said, and I'm not a Christian, but in the Bible it said, uh, God spoke things into existence. And even in the one of the Egyptian books it said, God spoke it and so it became. You know, so the power of the word is very powerful. You know, that's why they give me a hard time to try not to let my channel grow so much. Because what I'm doing on this channel could speak, could speak life into you. It can speak uh, better choice. It can speak wisdom into you. It, it's like uh, it's a key to life. You know what I'm saying? So if you're a chosen one and you're trying to speak positivity, a wisdom, life, love into somebody, there will always be an opposing force that comes in and tries to slow you down or stop you. So don't get scared. Uh, don't change your course. Stay true to who you are. Stay true to what you're doing. And if you're a chosen one, you have no choice but to do that. You can't. Once you know the truth and once you see life for what it really is, you have no other choice but to stay on that path. Because when you do things that are contradictory to who you are as a chosen one, to who you are as a good person, to who you are as one of God's people, it'll backfire on you instantly. God's people have instant karma. So when you're trying to be something you're not, it's gonna fuck you up at the end of the day. So you you have to stay true to who you are. You can't change that. You know, um, like I said, be you. Uh, if you're chosen, stay. Don't feel like you're born. Don't feel like. Don't let people make you feel uncomfortable. Don't let people change your path because that is who you are and that's who you're meant to be. And uh, if you're one of God's chosen elect few, he's going to guide you in the path to lead something else. What? I can't remember. I thought you want to pick it up on line three. It's Weinstein. I kept us covering the OD at the hospital. Go, Jack. Oh, that's great, Weinstein. No, I'll be down there in about 10 minutes. Just keep the door closed. Nobody will disturb him. Fine. Okay. Well, isn't that swell? Our OD is alive and well. And screaming. To promote love, to heal, to bless, to do. Because uh, God's children, we're doers. We're uh, givers. We're not takers. We're not people who come around trying to see if we can gain off the situation. 
that's how you know if you're you're not a good person if you're looking to gain from something you're not a good person if you're looking to give if you're looking to offer if you're looking to uh contribute that's how you know potentially that you're one of god's chosen elect people you know if you come into a situation um trying to bless coming to a situation trying not to harm you come into a situation trying to do your best no matter what you're facing that's how you know you're one of god's chosen people you know what i'm saying so stay stick to your course don't ever falter don't ever uh sway you know what i'm saying because when you go that to the left a little bit you might get lost you go to the right you stay righteous you'll stay on your path and god will bless you in so many ways and um you might even have to be alone you might have to do this by yourself you might have to you might lose somebody who you thought was good um who you loved and they weren't good for you when you stay on when you live a righteous path you'll lose a lot of negative people they're gonna leave your life they're gonna walk right out of your life they're gonna try to use and abuse you and then once they can't use and abuse you no more they're gonna leave and go to another uh decent person and try to break them down because there's breakers out here man there's definitely people out here who are sent to break god's children you know so do the work do the work you already know who you are inside but do the work to uh to really reach your truest potential and that's that means go within um ask god to give you the strength to go within and um be a better person every day uh ask god to help you not make so many mistakes ask god to guide you into the right path and keep you on the righteous path because it, it's it's a beautiful thing once you realize once you reach the point 